shining over the roughest and stormiest seas. It is a comforting sign of calm waters, a welcome harbor, and safe shelter. Today, it symbolizes guidance, light, and hope. Behind you hang wind chimes. Their tones calm our minds and connect us with our environment. Today, they bestow peace, good fortune, and happiness on Lauren, Robert, and all the family and friends that are gathered here today. Keith, why don't you give those chimes up so we can hear the tones. <laughs> In the distance, if you listen carefully, you can hear the waves crashing, excuse me, caressing gently on the beach. <laughs> 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 yeah, because the beach is a place that Lauren and Robert love, and a place that they love to be together. Welcome. We're going to start with a reading. I am not Mark Twain. <laughs> <laughs> Robert and Lawrence, I want you to hear these words, but mainly I want you to hear them. These were uttered by arguably the South's greatest thinker and writer, Mark Twain. Appropriately, it's called a marriage. A marriage makes of two fractional lives a whole. It gives us two purposeless a work and doubles the strength of each to perform it. It gives to two questioning natures a reason for living and something to live for, and it will give a new gladness to the sunshine a new fragrance to the flowers, a new beauty to the earth, and a new mystery to life. Now a reading by Evie Cummings. I carry your heart with me. I carry it in my heart by Evie Cummings. I carry your heart with me. I carry it in my heart. I am never without it. Anywhere I go, you go, my dear. And whatever is done by only me is your doing, my darling. I fear no fate, but you are my fate, my sweet. I want no world, for beautiful you are my world, my true. And it's you are. Whatever a moon has always meant, and whatever a sun will always sing, is you. Here is the deepest secret nobody knows. Here is the root of the root, and the bud of the bud, and the sky of the sky of a tree called life, which grows higher than the soul can hope, or mind 
can hide. And this is the wonder that keeps the stars apart. I carry your heart. I carry it in my heart. Now the bride and groom have actually prepared their own vows. Today, I choose you to be my wife, and as your husband, I promise you this. I will love you unconditionally, treat you with the respect that you deserve, and trust you casting no doubt. I vow to listen to you with compassion and understanding, and to speak with you with encouragement. I will laugh with you in times of joy, and I will comfort you in times of sorrow. I will share in your dreams and support you as you strive to achieve your goals. I promise to be your friend, your partner, and your lover. Today and forever, I promise you this. Um, Robert, I promise to encourage your goodness because that's what makes you unique and wonderful. I promise to nurture your dreams because through them your soul shines. I promise to help shoulder our challenges because there's nothing we can't face together. I promise to be your partner in all things because there's no one I'd rather take this journey with. I promise above all else to live in truth with you, to communicate fully and fearlessly for one lifetime with you can never be enough. Lastly, I promise to always be next to you screaming, go hokey. <laughs>